This is Taddy Grace, a photographer from Columbus, Georgia. This is Johnny Marigliano, a pizza baker from Brooklyn, New York. This is Lauren Cloud, a camp counselor from Boston, Massachusetts. This is Ray Barnard, a waiter from Los Angeles, California. And this is Kalila L., a dancer from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And they're all here to play the game of five in a row. Bingo! And here's our host, Michael Berger. Thank you very much. Very, very slippery back there. Thank you very much. I am Michael Berger, and welcome to Slingo. Hey, it's a show where we play with their lucky numbers, we play with my questions, and best of all, we play with our producer's money. And today, he's willing to give away, is that right, over $250,000, still good? Not so much? <laughs> he said we'd give it away, anybody want that? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, Johnny goes, yeah, why not? Let's play Slingo, come on, everybody. All right, here's how it works. Before the show, the players gave us their favorite numbers, the numbers they thought would bring them luck. And you're gonna see those numbers now fall into place. What we've done with those numbers is put money behind it. Anything between 250 and $1,000. And players, you know how it works. All you gotta do is match your number, answer a question correctly, and I'll give you the money. If you can match all your numbers, if you can fill up your row, five in a row is Slingo. Do that and I'll give you another $2,500. Come on. Those are the numbers. Shall we play the game for the first time? I say spin them. Let's play Slingo. Come on, everybody. There's a match. There's a match. No match there. Come on, we want matches. That's how we do it. Let me explain what this means. I've got a question for you. You're all eligible to buzz in. If you're right, you'll win $500. You're gonna lose $500 if you're wrong. But Taddy, Johnny, Ray, and Kalila all match one of their lucky numbers and they're real. That means if one of them answers this question correctly, not only do they get that $500, but they also win that bonus cash we've hidden behind their numbers. Now, Lauren, you don't have a matching number, but you're still able to answer this question and block them. And here comes the question for all of you. Condo, Lisa Rice. <laughs> On Friends, which one was Phoebe Buffay? <laughs> yeah, Kalila. Lisa. Lisa, that's right. <laughs> You've got $500 for that correct answer, and because you have that matching number in your reel, you get the bonus cash hidden behind your lucky number seven, and that is $1,000, giving you $1,500. Now that money is important because the three players with the most money are gonna move on to game two, where then you'll be a step closer to $250,000. So let's get spinning, here we go. This time, only Kalila has a matching number. Now, if she gets this question right, she'll get more bonus money. Everyone else, you're in this to block her. Here are your choices, and I gotta warn you, our writers haven't had a lot of sleep, so listen carefully. <laughs> Hong Kong, Ping Pong, King Kong. Which one has hollow white balls that weigh 2.7 grams? <laughs> yeah, Lauren. Ping Pong. Ping Pong balls, yes. That's $500 for you. No matching number in your reels, so no bonus cash, but let's get that fixed and start spinning those reels right now. Five in a row with Slingo. There's a match. There we go. Here we go, players. Bipolar Bear. Which one is one third of an in sync song title? Yeah, Teddy. Yes! Bye, bye, bye. Yeah, you're there. <laughs> bye is what we were looking for. Now, that's $500 for you. And again, no match in numbers, so no bonus cash, which is why you want to match those numbers. Spin again. All uh, right, looking for your numbers. Taddy's got a four. Uh, nothing for Johnny. Lauren's got a seven, and Ray matched the eight. Remember, matching those numbers means a chance at that bonus cash, but only if you get the question right. And here it comes. Harvard, Princeton, jail. Which one was Bill Gates home for almost three years? Yeah, Kalila. Jail. Incorrect, anybody else? Uh-huh, yes, Lauren. Princeton. Incorrect. Uh, the answer we were looking for was Harvard. Bill Gates was a Harvard dropout. Did you know that? Apparently not, otherwise you would have got that right. Kalila and Lauren got that one wrong. Yeah, I gotta take $500 away from you for a wrong guess. All right, we're gonna take our first break, take a look at the scores here. Kalila has 1,000 and Taddy has 500 and uh, Johnny and Lauren and Ray are in a three-way tie with nothing. More Slingo after this.
That's if you'd I'm like saying. to win at home, send a text message to 49544. We'll announce the winner at the end of the show. Good luck. Thank you very much. Welcome back to Slingo. Quick little look at the scores here. Kalila has a thousand. Taddy has five hundred. And uh, Johnny, Lauren, and Ray looking to join us in Slingo. You got to remember this, folks. Money is important. The three players with the most money are going to move on to game two. From there, you're going to be one step closer to two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Do you need more encouragement than that? I also got to warn you that in this round, you might get the company of the devil. The devil may show up when that happens. Trust me, you're going to know it. But spin those reels. Here we go. All right, that's two players with matching numbers, two chances for some bonus cash. Here we go with the question. Num nuts, putts, and Fokker. Which one is a pitcher for the Seattle Mariners? Yeah, Ray. Putts. That is right, J.J. Putts. He is the only putts in baseball, I believe. That's correct for $500. All right, players, spin again. Here we go. Oh. The reason Kalila is so happy is that she is one away from a slingo, but you got to get the question right to get your slingo. The four of you want to stop her. The question's for everybody, as always, and here it comes. Orville, Wilbur, Frank Lloyd. Which one is selling popcorn years after his death? Yeah, Kalila, for a slingo. Orville! That is right! That's the name of the game. We give you 2500 for the slingo. Well, you pick up $500 for a right answer. You had some bonus money. How much did she have behind the bonus? She had another 775 for a total of 4775 So the rest of you, you got your work cut out for you. Spin again. Here we go. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, Johnny, the devil has paid you a visit. Here's how it works. I've got one question just for you. Get the question right, and the devil and you can steal a thousand bucks. That's double the value of the question from any of the other players up here. Get the question wrong, and the devil steals a thousand bucks from you, Johnny. All here right. comes the question just for you. Ham sandwich. Which was the first chimp launched into space by NASA? That would be Sam. Incorrect. The chimp's name was Ham, believe it or not. An explorer and an entree. That's what he was. I'm sorry. I got to take it. Oh, and I got to tell you, time is up. So let's add things up. The three players with the most money and moving on would be Kalila with $4,775, Ray with $500, and Taddy with $500. Johnny and Lauren, I'm sorry it didn't work out. Good luck to both of you. To the three of you, it is good news. Here's what's going to happen. We're going to come back. We're going to play game two. Dollar values are double. The Slingle is worth $5,000. And one of those three people will be moving on for their shot at $250,000. My Slingle right after this. Back to Slingo. We have our three players set for game two. Kalila, you have $4,775. Ray has $500. Kathy has $500. Congratulations to the three of you. Game two, speaking of money, everything is doubled. Questions are worth $1,000. A Slingo is worth $5,000. That's something you want to go for. Woo! And the great news here is that the player with the most money at the end of this game gets to keep all the money they made. Then they will also have their shot at $250,000. Isn't that good news? I think so. Load their favorite numbers again for us, if you would. And as always, here comes the spin. All right, Ray, you matched the number. That's how you get your bonus cash. You know that by now. Players, get ready. I guarantee these questions are going to be fun. Here it comes. Brittany, who's your daddy? Which one is a breed of dog? 
Yeah, Taddy. Who's here? No, anybody else? Yeah, Ray. Brittany. That is right. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, Taddy, I gotta take a thousand away from you. That puts you 500 in the hole. Ray, good news for you, you pick up a thousand, plus there's some bonus money behind that five. It's one of your lucky numbers. How much money? $650. Well done. Let's spin again, here we go. Two more matches, okay. here comes the question. Llama Llama Ding Dong. <laughs> Which was first marketed by Hostess in 1967? <laughs> Looks like Kalila. Ding Dong. Ding Dong. <laughs> Snack cake, right? Yes. Another thousand for you. And you also found a lucky number behind the four, $2,000. Whoa. <laughs> Ray and Daddy. You better slow her down. She's getting hard to catch. All right, spin again. Here we go. Come on, let's chase Kalila. Come on, Slingo. Oh, you got a match there. That's good. Oh, a match there. Oh, we like seeing that. That's three matches. Listen carefully. 99, 86, 288. Which one is just too gross? Yeah, Taddy. 99? Incorrect. Yeah, Ray. 288. That is right. <laughs> Sorry, I gotta take another thousand from the patty. But now, Ray, you pick up a thousand bucks there, plus more money behind that nine. Let's see, 500 bucks. You make it a comeback. Let's spin again. Here we go. All right, players, come on now. Oh, baby. <laughs> All right, Ray and Kalila found matches, but more importantly, Taddy, you got a visit from the devil. You ready? Bring it on. Okay. Remember, the devil always steals double, so this could be worth $2,000 from either Ray or Kalila. However, get it wrong, and you're going to drop another $2,000. All right? A lot riding on this. Here comes a question just for you, Taddy. Gluttony, pride, sloth. In the animal world, which one is a group of lions? Pride. Pride is right. That's how you do it. With that correct answer, you can steal $2,000 from either Ray, who has $3,650, or Kalila, who has $7,775. Who's the biggest threat? I'm going to go with Kalila. Yeah. Kalila, you're going to drop down two grand to $5,775. Okay, on that last spin, both Ray and Kalila matched a number. So here's another question, and it's for all of you. A-O-L. Which one is a fashion magazine title? Yes, Teddy. L. L, a French magazine. That's how you do it. She's trying to make a comeback. That's thousand for a correct answer there. And we spin again. Here we go. All right. Oh, boy. Look at the board players. Ray is one away from a slingo. If you can get this right, you can pick up $5,000. A right answer here, Ray. You jump into the lead. The two of you, Kalila and Taddy, you gotta stop them. Everyone plays. Here comes the question. Rosemary Clooney. <laughs> Which one is part of the lyrics of a Simon and Garfunkel song? Yes, Ray. Rosemary. That's it. Yay! Well, you picked up a thousand and you got bonus money and you got yourself a slingo! But you jump into the lead now with $11,200. Oh! Time is up! We do the math and it is you, Ray, who gets to move on to Super Slingo! Kalila and Taddy, I hope you had a good time. It was great meeting you. But it is you, Ray, $11,200. That is yours to keep. More importantly, you're going to go with me to Super Slingo, where you could leave today with $250,000. Wouldn't that be nice? Take a break. Be right back. Coming up next, Super Slingo and a chance at up to a quarter of a million dollars. Welcome back. Well, it is Ray Barnhart who made it to Super Slingo. Uh, congratulations. Thank you. If you think about it, there's nothing left to do, nothing left to worry about it. No more opponents, nope. no more questions. It's just you, me, and the numbers. Right. And speaking of numbers, in the past couple games, you picked up $11,200. Right. That's yours to keep. Yeah. And you're a waiter. Yes. So money's good. 
Well, uh, we could always use more. How about two hundred and fifty thousand uh, dollars yeah. as we play Super Slingo? Come on! Yeah. All right, turn around. Ray, I got three columns here where you can win some cash. Every time you match a number, we're going to light it up. If you can get a Slingo in that first column, I will give you ten thousand dollars. Get a Slingo in that second column, so I'll give you twenty-five thousand dollars, Ray. And Ray, as you know, if you can get a Slingo in that last column. Match all five of your lucky numbers. I will give you two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. That is a lot of tip money, Ray. Yeah. All right, you've got five spins to do this in. Your financial freedom now is in motion. You stop those reels when you think it's right. That's how you do it. Yeah. All right. There you go. Good start. In one spin, you picked up two numbers. Right. That's great. Yeah. It's a very good path that you're on. Yes. All right, spin again. Go get some more numbers. You got four spins left. All right. There you go. There you go. There you go. This is nothing to this. Do you sense how close you are to the money? I feel like I'm closer. Yeah. Have you ever yeah. been this close to a quarter million? No. Okay. Well, then I'm not going to keep you. Three more spins. Start again. Come on. All right, how about that 25 dollars No. Yeah! Ray, yeah. in school, yeah. were you good at math? Not great. Look at that $250,000 column. Two numbers left, right? Yeah. You have two spins. That's a good position to be in, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> no? Oh. There you go, Ray. There you go, Ray. Ray, you have one spin left. You were one number away from a quarter million. All right? Go get him, buddy. Yeah. Okay, now hold on, hold on. You're one number away from a quarter million, Ray. You all right? I'm a little nervous. Okay, what are you thinking? I want to spin. Well, then go, baby, get it. Oh! Okay. All right, but so close, right? Let's do the quick math here. How many numbers did you match? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, we give you $500 for each one, so that's $3,500 that you've got. <laughs> Decent money. But you're so close. Yeah. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna let you keep spinning until you get a Slingo. But I gotta warn you, the devil is back in play. Okay. All right, now if the devil shows up on any one of these reels, you would lose the $3,500 you just made. All right, but you are one number away. So here's the choice, Ray. You can leave with the 3,500, or you can risk that and go for the big money. What do you want to do? I want to go for it. Going to go for it. All right, Ray. First of all, you'd love to snack that six right off the bat. Here we go. No devil, just numbers. Oh, terrific. That's ten thousand dollars, but you got two reels to stop. You got to avoid the devil. If you do, that ten thousand's yours. Ray, if the seven comes up, it's two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. No devil, no devil. No devil. That means ten thousand dollars. Yeah. Now, Ray, that's great news. Yeah. You know you've won ten grand, but you know this game can continue if you want it to. Right. Ten thousand dollars. You can leave with the money now, or you can risk it because I'm telling you. It's one number away as long as you don't get the devil. What's going through your mind? I'm so close and I have some money anyway, so I, I want to go. I want to keep going. You're going to risk it. All right. I want to go. It's a $10,000 risk. I know. All right. I know. All right. We've got two reels spinning. Let's look at the first one. Okay. Uh, numbers almost don't matter at this point. You just don't want the devil in this reel. So stop that when you think the moment's right, Ray. All right. Great. Great. That's out of the way. Here's what can happen, Ray. If the devil comes up in that last reel, you're going to lose that ten thousand. But if you get that seven, it's a quarter of a million dollars. I'm going to leave you a moment to think about that, Ray. I'd love to see that seven hit. If it hits, it's two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Good luck. You got it. You got it, baby. Two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. These are in fact your lucky numbers. Ha, 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 ha!
Plus the money you made up front with another 11,020. We're gonna do the math. Randy, give me more good news. More good news, Michael. We have a big winner at home, Eleanor Parisi of Princeton, Rhode Island. You just won $10,000. Tune in tomorrow for another chance to win at home. Back to you, Michael. Ray, the quick math is $261,200. Congratulations. Are you, gonna, you. are you gonna stay a waiter? I, I don't know. I think he's gonna quit. <laughs> it's our first quarter million dollar winner. Congratulations. Yeah. Folks, come back next time. I'd love to do it all over again. I don't know if the producer's got any money left, but I'm gonna try to give it away on Michael Burger. See you next time. Thank you. Congratulations, Thank Ray. You. That's how you do it. All right. <laughs> if you like this, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more and check out my Facebook page for other exciting content.